Okay, solving e exponential equations with unlike bases takes a little manipulation. What you have to do is get the bases to be the same thing, and these are not. So if I can change that 125 to be the base of 5, I can um, work these problems by setting the exponents equal to each other and solving it. I know I need it to be a 5, and you're having to think about, well, 5 to what power is 125? Well, 5 to the first power is 5, and 5 second power is 25, and 5 cubed is 125. So we found it already. So I'm going to make this 5 cubed. So 5x equals 5 cubed. So all I have to do now is let the um, exponents equal each other. x equals 3. So 5 cubed equals 125. We found it. Now on this one right here, I've got a four and a two, and those are not the same base, so I need them to be. I need to change this four into a two, and that's pretty easily because four is two squared. So I can change the four to two squared, and then that's raised to the x, and literally, when you have a power raised to a power, you multiply it, so it's two times two x um, equals two times the x minus three. So two, I think I said it wrong, two raised to the two x equals two raised to the x minus three, since the bases are the same. Now I can say two x equals x minus three, and then subtract x from both sides. I have x equals negative three. So there's the second one. And now these, um, there is no nine, nine times, um, 9 to the first power is 9, 9 to the second power is 81. I can't make them 9s, but I want you to think about 3s. I, I can turn these into 3s. 9 is 3 squared, and that can change to 3 squared to the x plus 2. And on this one, 27 is 3 cubed. 3 cubed is 27. So I can raise a power to a power by multiplying that. So that's 3. It's like distribution. 2x plus 4, 2 times x is 2x, 2 times 2 is 4, equals 3 to the 3x. All right, so the bases are the same. I can set the exponents equal to each other. 2x plus 4 equals 3x. And then I want to get rid of this 2x so that I can have the x's on the same side. And I have 4 equals x. And we're done.